All right, Max. Max, uh, Lars and I, we're out here. We're out here uh, on the Minnesota side of the uh, Rainy River. Canada is right over there. That's Canada. And we are sturgeon fishing with sleigh spoons. Basically what we're doing is we've got this little setup we've learned from YouTube videos where we have the bobber going uh, into the snow and then we have the sleigh spoon resting on the bottom with some shiners. So if it gets hit, the bobber will uh, move out of the snow. It's a great way to detect uh, little bites. And then we'll set the hook and we'll be on. Plan to stay out here pretty late, so let's see what happens. That one. It's probably not big. Probably like a little guy. Oh, it's a Walter. Oh! I just got a walleye. So I just got this guy. He's a little small, but I think he's a good eater size. He'll be good for dinner tonight since we don't want to buy food. Got one. Woo! Little Walter! This is another eater for tonight, huh? Can't catch sturgeon, but can catch the Walters. Yeah, we're just out here. Uh, it's uh, not dark yet, but uh, we just uh, decided while we're waiting for it to get dark and the sturgeon bite to turn on, we tried jigging some of these walleye we've been seeing down there all day. We are on the Rainy River, of course, one of the best walleye fisheries in Minnesota, so might as well give it a try. Got this nice little guy, we'll throw him on the ice, fry him up tonight. Ooh, Ooh, that's a keep. Yeah. We're keeping! <laughs> it's another keeper. We're gonna have a nice little catch and cook tonight. What's up, Facebooks? So, we've been out here for a long time. It's been a while since our last fish. We're getting a little walleye bite on our sturgeon rigs every 30 to 40 minutes. So you could say we're keyed in on the bite right now. It is currently... Where's my phone? Who cares about the time? No one fucking cares about the time. Yeah. It, so we're, it's, not, it's not terribly late. We still got time out here. Still hopeful. But, you know, we're keyed in on the bite. So I'm having a great time here. Look at this. Major setups here. The camera's foggy as fuck. We got triple holes going. Double heaters. Snacks. C4. C4 energy drink. This, th this stuff is crazy. Of course, of course we're fishing with sleigh spoons. Of course we've got sleigh spoons on the bottom with minnows. So, you know, we out here on the rainy river. You know, just trying to catch some fish. Oh, I got one! I told you that would happen. Feels like a fish, but I don't know. Yeah. Oh, it's oh, a it's Oh my god! No! Oh. Oh. <laughs> no! Oh, good, you get. I'm gonna start live streaming. No! Oh my god, hey, guys. Need... That was crazy. If you guys don't know what just happened, um, Max and I have been, uh, and Lars, we've been getting hit on our sturgeon rods, really light taps. We've been assuming they're walleye. But I finally got one on the hook set. And it's a bourbon. And it's a bourbon. And what happened here was I set the hook, but my line got all tangled because of the bobber. Is that and what Max, happened? Yeah, Max hand lined it in. So that's why we got this mess of line. But this is the first bourbon Max and I have oh, ever shit. caught. This thing's going right on the fryer. Yeah, yeah. This thing may look gross, but this is a cod, basically. It's, you know, you can it, buy cod at grocery feels stores. It's like a. Like oh my god. It's maybe. like a salamander fish. Dude, that is such a mess of Hold line. Hold it up in the light. Can't really get it. Oh my god. <sighs> Look at this thing. Oh. Not the biggest one, but it's pretty cool that we caught it. Yeah, what the fuck? We're gonna throw this guy on the ice here, fry him up tonight or tomorrow. Alright, a little update on the burbot catch and cook situation. Our burbot got jacked by a fox. Lars went out to take a little piss break and uh Go out there, we got the three walleye sitting on the ice. Burb's gone. There's <laughs> fox prints everywhere. Burb's just gone. Yeah. So now we're committed. We gotta stay out here to get another burb to bring you guys our a new species for our catch and cook here. Catch and cook burbot. We're ready? We we're keyed in. Right we're now. keyed in on the burb bite. So we'll we'll update you guys if something happens here. We really want to get another burb. If you can press no try to press play on that one. Fuck! No! What is it? It's gone! No! What the fuck? What no. happened there? It just popped off. 
I think it hit the ice. I saw something. Yeah, it definitely hit it at the ice. So you gotta be so careful. I think it was a big burb. I yeah, I think you actually had a giant burb. That was crazy, dude. Fuck. Really? Yes, it is. Hey, Nils, Nils, let me get over there, and I'm gonna. Oh, pee. oh, it's a oh, it's not even, no, it's a, a burb. It's a burb. It's not a, a huge burb. one, but still burb. Still burb. He'll eat. He'll eat. That yeah, makes up for away from the hole, though. Yeah. That makes um, up for the one we just lost. All right, we're keyed oh, in on the so burbs nice. now. Lars just Lars lost. Is that, more like Lars is keyed in. Yeah, on Lars the is keyed in on the burbs. Lars just lost probably a ten pounder a little while ago, and he just he just got this nice little eater. We're not gonna make the mistake this time and leave him outside. What are we using today, Nils, to cook these things? To cook them? Yeah. Well, of course, we are using Chef Fruit Homie's Magic Salmon Seasoning. Please sponsor us with some Coop's Arizona Heat. Mm -mm. It's Flavor Town. Welcome to Flavor Town. But actually, we're using um, Shore Lunch Beer Batter. Our family <laughs> vegetable oil. Some Lando Lakes butter. Yeah. Pretty good. good. Alright, so we're back at the motel. We're gonna try some of this burb. What do you think? Mm. I actually kind of like that a lot. I like the walleye has kind of like a. kind of tastes like the water, like a little bit of irony or something. This just has no taste. It's really nice. It's just a freaking. Yeah. It's a wham into a wham into fillet. I'll tell you what. <laughs> yeah, it's it's actually pretty pretty good. Nice. So, pretty successful trip out here on Rainy River. Got some nice walleye. Got some nice burbs. Now we're eating because we didn't bring any food or water. This is very nice. Oh, fish, John.